morning from Barcelona. My name is Ivana. So today is our last full day in Barcelona and before we head out to new adventures, we are going to have breakfast. Good morning, Nadine. Morning. She is so excited about the breakfast. Mm -hmm. I'm hungry. <laughs> breakfast. So I have toast with cream cheese. The cream cheese is so good. Some yogurt, fruit. Yes, I'm being healthy today. And Nadine has uh, egg and cheese. Toast. Very basic. <laughs> We're being so healthy today, but they don't have the cream filled donuts. And we're so disappointed because Drama. I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> what does it say about the rest of our day? I'm such a rhymer. I'm such a rapper, you know? <laughs> it is 12 p.m. We're on our way to the Gothic Quarter. Apparently, there's a metro party. <laughs> in the metro abroad when they have uh, people playing music and stuff in the Paris metro you also have quite a lot of street artists metro artists and it's and in really what? Prague also. oh in Prague also yeah it's too bad that they're not allowed to <laughs> do, do the it shipping. in a do the shipping. <laughs> do you the, the, but those were in Paris oh wasn't it yeah yeah yeah, oh, yeah. they were twerking they were twerking oh, yeah. in the metro that was so much fun uh, it is 12 30 we are on our way to a nice park for a little stroll on this beautiful sunny day in Barcelona. Barcelona. Say it, baby. Barcelo Barcelona. <laughs> We're just walking around and ran into this pastry shop. Look at this. Naked carrot cake. Naked chocolate cake. Yeah, also pizza. Cupcakes. Oh, Nutella pizza. Oh, the cupcakes look so good, man. The park is on the other side of the street, but look at this building. Literally every building here is so beautiful and all the alleyways are touristy attraction on their own. Love it. Made it to the park and we're just strolling around, enjoying the nice and sunny weather. A lot of people hanging out here. Loving it, man. This park is so pretty. Look at the palm trees. Well, those are not palm trees, but there are plenty of palm trees. Baruch, loving it. Also, there are some fountains over there, so we're going to check that out. Holy schmeckers. Okay, guys, in real life, this is 10 times as pretty as it comes off on camera because it's huge. 12 fountains, 12 fountains, and I probably forgot some too. This is insane. Wow, this little spot in the park is like you just ended up in a theme park, but it's just in a park. Loving it. We're just walking up the stairs, going to the top fountain. Oh. Wow. Okay, this is after the first stairs. It's so pretty! Got closer to the main fountain. Look at this girl, by the way. This is my Insta post. <laughs> it's inspired by her. Play with your hair. Play with your hair. Look at that. <laughs> Climbing more steps towards the main fountain. Look at this. Look at those golden statues up there. This place is so pretty. Wow, this is such a gorgeous place. And then find graffiti of a blood. Awesome, great job guys. View from the top. I have to say the view from downstairs is better. Then you get like an overview of everything of all the fountains and the main fountain you can see it from up here. Strolling around the park and we found the phone. Oh it's so windy now. Look, you can also rent a boat. Yeah, but that's probably when it's really warm. Found the park bench and are chilling in the sun. There are geese over here. And they are so massive. And apparently, according to Stefan, they can break your legs. You don't understand how big they are. I think this 
gives you a better impression. Look at the pigeons over there. Look at the geese over here. Pigeon, geese, pigeon, geese. Those wings, man, they can break your legs. No joke. Oh, wait, the pigeons are coming to play. Yes, little pigeon. What do you want? What do you want, mister? Don't have any food for you. We're just gonna sit here quietly, ignore them, don't make eye contact, and hope we don't end up as a viral video like the attack of the geese. <laughs> Two girls got their legs broken by geese in Barcelona. No, don't make eye contact. Avoid eye contact, avoid eye contact. <laughs> this is really an amazing park, so if you want to go, this is what it's called. Parque de la Ciutadella. We were hungry and randomly ran into this burger restaurant. This one, Masoa. And they have vegetarian burger, two varieties. So this is the black bean burger. And also you can order this with a bun. And this is the, I don't know, oh, the chickpea spinach burger. And you can order that one with a salad. Actually, you can order all burgers with a salad or with a bun. And we're going to try if this is good. Mm. Mine is very tasty. Mm. Mine as well. Yeah? It's approved by the culinary critic. OMG, OMG, guys. Woohoo! Mm. So good. Take a look at their sauces. Ketchup. This is something Brava Picante. I don't know, I guess it's spicy sauce. And this one. It's like a, I guess, red bell pepper sauce or something. I'm, I'm loving these bottles that they serve it in. This is really a cool place. Decided to also order some potatoes, rusticas. And this is the spicy sauce, that one. I like it. Miss Culinary Critic, what's the verdict? <laughs> really? Awesome. Yes, they're very crispy, very fresh. Mm. Our tummies are full. This was some really good food. Can highly recommend it. And our next stop, or actually our next walk, is going to be the Gothic Quarter. Ooh. Just getting lost in the small creepy alleys. <laughs> no, they're actually pretty. Loving the balconies, man. Ooh. Narrow alleys. Barcelona seriously got their vegetarian and vegan food on lockdown. Look at this. We just found a vegetarian restaurant over there, and this is a vegan deli shop. Hi! <laughs> They have so many vegetarian options and actually also a lot of vegan options. Nadine and I was, were uh, like randomly discussing would you prefer London, Paris or Barcelona? And we both came to the conclusion Barcelona. One, because of the weather, it's never that cold here as it is in Paris and London. Also, it's a lot cheaper, like nowhere near Paris or London. It's gorgeous. Look at the small square behind me. There's so much to see and the food is just on point, man. Barcelona, Barcelona, you totally surprised us. You totally surprised us. <laughs> Making us happy and stuff. Actually, surprised me surprised us because maybe we wouldn't have gone to Barcelona because of all the other options in Europe. But we are very happy to be here. And they have so many hipster places to eat. It's awesome. I can highly recommend it. Thank you, surprise me. We ended up on the same square that we visited the first day. And it's supposed to be a very famous square. One more awesome thing about Barcelona, you can walk to a lot of places. So we just walked from the park to the Gothic Quarter. La Rambla is behind over there. Of course, the, the metro is very convenient, but I just love a city where you can walk to a lot of places. In case you go to Spain, you cannot miss out on this. Churros. And we looked up one of the best churrerias in Barcelona. Got it. 
and I made a mistake. I didn't get the fresh ones because I thought we would put chocolate sauce on top, so I got the chocolate churros, of course. But the fresh ones are with sugar. Look, I just made them like literally fresh, <laughs> freshly fried churros. But oh well. Let me try this. Mm. Oh. oh, it's chocolate from the it's inside. Chocolate as coated. Well. Yeah. Too oh, bad. Oh. Okay, don't make the same mistake I do. They're still tasty. Yeah. It's not the fresh ones. Fresh churros are the best. Mm -hmm. You're like, where, where, where? She got this bacon and cheese. Chipsting. Chipsting. Mm. Wow, this is such a coincidence. Thank you, universe. The first time I came to Barcelona, I remember eating churros and having like the hot melted chocolate and then you dip them in that hot melted chocolate. And that place was, um, I think I got it out of a guidebook or something. Nadine and I were just walking around and this is the place. We just found it randomly. So this is where we're going to have churros the proper way. It's also very, very cute and look at the stuff that they have, man. Nom, 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 all the cakes. All naked cakes, look at that. Pinterest is making an impact, man. Naked, naked. I don't know what these chocolate balls are. This, this is the Tudor's experience. I already dipped it for Instagram picture, of course. But this is like molten chocolate and then you dip the churros and it's delish. And Aline has the red velvet cake. Okay, food critic. What is the verdict? Is it good? It's delicious, but the cream. Yeah, this one. Yeah, it's absolutely disgusting. Oh really? <laughs> <laughs> she is very honest. That's what I told you guys. So the red velvet is good. Mm -hmm. It's not dry because red velvet is always so dry. No, no. No? Okay. Not dry at all. Nice. Churro. <laughs> This. this is what you need in Barcelona or Spain in general. Mm. Churros experience. Loving it, loving it. I was just telling Nadine, seriously, for me, when I sleep enough, I'm a happy camper. When I have good food, I'm a very, very happy camper. Really, nothing can. It can upset me. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. And that red velvet is really, really good. <laughs> it's delish. It's moist. It's not dry. Nadine and I just chatted for hours. And hours. <laughs> and hours. And, hours. <laughs> and now it's almost time for dinner again. Oh. Because that's just what we're doing today. Chilling, eating, walking around. And it's awesome in Barcelona. Barcelona. We're going to eat here another vegetarian restaurant we're eating again i have vegetable fajitas and nadine has vegetable lasagna lots of cheese missy's not impressed <laughs> on first sight <laughs> it's good you could use some more spices but it's tasty it's a little bit bland it's a little bit bland. The other one is better. Yeah, the other one is better. Mm -hmm. so they could yeah. do, do some more spices, some more yeah, some more pepper, oomph. Yeah. Yes, you know. yeah. It's 9 p.m. We are on our way to the hotel again. And we're going to actually try to watch Vlog Milka Vlog again. <laughs> but first shower and get to bed and then try to watch it. Feeling so royal. <gasps> wow, we already have quite a nice view. She just wants to get it over with. She's not excited at all. No, sorry, I can't eat this. Why? Tastes good, man. I don't taste good. 